All right, man, I, I had no intention on doing this video, but I'm, I'm sick of this shit. Um, I'm going to be ranting about this book, all of the Marvels, and I feel sad to do this because this was a gift for Christmas um, from my grandma. Um, but um, yeah, it's, it's terrible. I'm not even finished reading it. I still got that much left um, to read. But if you remember my book haul that I did, I showed this off and was like, I don't really know what this is, but it's about Marvel Comics. And, you know, I'm a big fan of, you know, Marvel and comics and all that shit. So I was like, all right, this this will be interesting. And the premise seems interesting at first. It's about this guy, Douglas Wolk, who goes through every single Marvel comic, well, mostly every single one, and reads them. Um... And basically is just writing about his experience on how that went and kind of analyzing it. And analyzing certain story arcs and certain issues and all that shit. Um, but it's political. For no fucking reason. For no reason. He tries to like make it seem like Marvel Comics have always been political. And he's like, oh, you know, there's there's always political shit in these. And, you know, superheroes are blah, 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 blah. I mean, that's what he makes it seem like. And he's talking about, like, I won't get into it because, I, like, I, I don't want to get into the details. But, like, I'm just going to leave it at that. It's political. I just hate that shit. I'm just going to leave it at that because I, I don't want to go I don't want to. This, this could get messy real easily. And I'm not because... It pisses me off that it's like, why are you still reading the book, Jack? Um, well, because there, there's like small moments that are kind of neat because he talks about like, um, when he's not being political as shit. Um, you know, there's some interesting stuff. And like, again, the premise seems super cool. And I'm kind of waiting for him to get to like, um, but by the way, the structure of this book's terrible as well. You're not supposed to read it like front to back. You're supposed to skip around. He even says that at the beginning, but um i don't care i'm going to read it front to back um but yeah like i'm trying to wait like um kind of for him to get to certain superheroes he talked about spider-man and stuff and that was cool whatever but um there's moments multiple moments a lot of moments that are just like what and um, part of it might be my ocd i just i want to get through it i mean i'm almost done i i've i've read most of the book at this point and um it might not make sense to some people. It's like, well, if you're not enjoying the book. But, like, there's some moments I enjoy, I will say. But at the end of the day, like, this book's terrible. <laughs> I just, I want to rant about this book. It's terrible, man. It's like, also, this guy needs, I'll show you this guy. Douglas Wolk. Man. Let me see. You see that guy? He needs to get some bitches. Like... It's almost too nerdy for me, this book. Because it's like... And I also, I swear he's making shit up. I can't... Like, I don't think... That, I don't even think this is real. This is, like, fake. Like, like honestly, it's how I feel. It probably isn't. But he's probably picking and choosing certain Marvel comics. Like, he, he, he even says that, like, he hasn't... He doesn't read um, every single, like, you know, spinoff and certain things. Because some of it's not really Marvel. Or I don't know what the hell he says. He... He uses big words to try and confuse you as well. Um, and, but the structure of this book's terrible as well. Um, there's little, like, cliff notes at the bottom. And it's just, like, so tiresome. And this book's tedious. And it's like, again, people are like, then why are you reading it? It's like, I don't know. But basically, at the end of the day, my point is, I'm just pissed because it's a book about Marvel. And the premise seems so good about this guy going through all the Marvel comics and, and whatever, whatever. But it's it's about politics, and he's dissecting politics out of Marvel Comics. He's picking and choosing at the end of the day. He's completely picking and choosing what he decides to analyze and doesn't decide to analyze. And that's not okay. Um, obviously, you can't analyze every single issue. Um, but when you choose to go on this path of making it political and not even about the superheroes and trying to prove, like, whoa, Spider-Man, oh my god, and, and fucking, what, what other, sh like, I don't know, like, the X-Men, they're different from society, and, like, it's like a, 
I don't know. But there's other, there's other stuff. I, again, I, I, I should not get into specifics because I don't want to reveal too much about um, certain things that go on in this book and blah, 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 blah. And it's just... Because, again, it could get messy real quick. But, yeah, it's political for no reason. It's terrible. It's got to be one of the worst books I've read in a while, and I haven't finished it. Um, I'm kind of just waiting for him to get to one of the other superheroes. Because sometimes, again... Some people are going to be like, why are you reading it? I know I've said that already multiple times, but I'm just, I don't care. I'm reading it. I try to give every book a chance. Books are different, though, from movies. Because um, it's like, if you read so far in a book and then you're bored by it, it's like, just stop. But with a movie, it's different because it doesn't, because books are so time consuming. So that's, that's all I'm trying to say. But um, I've read this far into it already just recently though i will yeah i will say the the last few chapters have been really bad um like earlier on it wasn't too bad it was still kind of tedious with its structure um it's it's just structured poorly um like i kind of get what he's trying to go for but yeah at the end of the day douglas wolf you need to get some bitches um because you're kind of a nerd um and i'm a nerd too but you're a bigger nerd than i am and you're making like you're picking and choosing out of your fucking ass at the end of the day. And yeah, I'm going to leave it at that before I um, get <laughs> get too crazy. Maybe I already have gotten too crazy. But yeah. Do not read all of the Marvels. I'm sorry, Grandma, that you got me this book. Um, I still love you and I appreciate it because it was a nice thought and gifts are good. Um, and there was some good stuff. If even if it was a small amount, um, and it had an interesting premise, it's just it wasn't executed properly, and um, yeah, all right, I'm done. Just terrible book.